Most of us have traveled by air in some fashion, but these creations are far from your standard jumbo jet. This is Reacher, and we're bringing you 10 unusual aircraft to keep your eyes on. Number 10. This reinvention of the helicopter has upped the personal flight game. Designed to fit two people, the Surefly's eight propellers are each driven by their own unique motor. Each of the four arms fold down to allow it to be stowed away in a space the size of a standard home garage. Its intended use is for shorter journeys as it only has an approximate flight time of one hour per tank of fuel. But with a top speed of 70 miles per hour and a flight ceiling of 4,000 feet, this should be more than enough. If you're interested, the company is currently taking reservations. The expected price is around $200,000 with a projected release date sometime in 2019. Number 9 First flown in 1978, the prototype of the Rutan Defiant was a proof of concept design for a light twin aircraft. Designed by aerospace engineer Burt Rutan, it uses a combination of forward and backward mounted propellers and a push-pull configuration. The fiberglass over styrofoam body has a length of just under 23 feet with a wingspan of 31 feet. It topped out at a maximum speed of 216 miles per hour with a range around 1100 miles. Certification was sought in 1979, but the company was unable to secure financing which led to the design being modified to a home-built kit. As of 2005, there were only 19 of these aircraft registered with the FAA. Number 8 Although it doesn't have an official name, this entry from UK-based Vertical Aerospace is already in the prototype stages having completed unmanned test flights with full-size models. The company's objective is to use these aircraft in a piloted air taxi service by the year 2022. The body of the aircraft looks like a scaled up version of your standard remote controlled drone with a central fuselage and rotors on each corner of the craft. There are plans to develop multiple sizes of the aircraft with room for two to six passengers and a flight ceiling up to 3,000 feet. The estimated flight range is 100 miles with a top speed of 150 miles per hour. Can you imagine a world where being late for work is a thing of the past? Number 7 The word luxury doesn't do this machine justice. The Valkyrie is the flagship of the Cobalt aircraft line with its sleek exterior that draws its inspiration from the look of a classic fighter jet and an interior that is almost fully covered in hand-stitched leather. It has a wingspan and length, both measuring 30 feet, with a cabin that can seat up to five people while still having plenty of room for storage. The 350 horsepower engine can produce a top speed of 300 miles per hour with a flight range around 1,650 miles. The original cost was estimated to be around $700,000. As of July 2018, the project is running under the company name of Centauri Aircraft. If you found this one interesting so far, be sure and hit that subscribe button and click that bell icon to stay up to date on all of our latest videos. Number 6 First developed in 1991, the Cayman K-Max is the world's first helicopter designed with the sole purpose of being used as an aerial crane. The narrow profile and bulging side windows provide the pilot a view of any cargo and the surroundings from either side of the aircraft. Upon closer inspection, you'll notice that this one has intermeshing rotors mounted side by side and there's no tail rotor. The single seater has a top speed of 115 miles per hour with a payload capacity of 6,000 pounds. Only 38 were built before production ceased in 2003. The company restarted in 2015 with the first delivery of a new unit in mid-2017. They've also created an unmanned remote controlled version that's been evaluated for extended practical service. The standard pricing on this one? A cool seven million dollars. Number 7 
Number five. This single person aircraft, nicknamed the Concepto Millennia, has the look of a standard remote controlled drone if it were on steroids. It was modeled after a sports car while trying to mimic the feeling of sitting in a Formula One vehicle. The current prototype has a top speed around 40 miles per hour with a weight capacity of 150 pounds. In mid-2018, the inventor partnered with Star 8, an Australian company known for their e-vehicles and green energy initiatives. The goal is to develop a commercial version which can seat two people with a total weight capacity of 440 pounds and a flight time up to an hour. Number 4 this next entry from Norwegian-based Equator Aircraft finally hit the pinnacle of testing after eight years with a successful flight in January of 2018. The P-2 Excursion has side-by-side -side seating for two people with an intuitive control setup that uses the hands only. The electric motor offers a current flight time of just under two hours while the hybrid system can reach up to six hours. The maximum cruising speed is 150 miles per hour with a range of 975 miles. The design also allows for it to land on water as the landing gear can retract into the carbon and Kevlar composite airframe. The company recently ended its crowdfunding campaign, finding enough investment capital to reach their intended production of over 150 planes per year by 2025. Number 3 Almost anyone who's ever flown can attest to disliking the time spent waiting at the airport. This entry by XTI is set to help eliminate that wasted time by offering direct point-to-point -point travel. The TriFan 600 is a VTOL aircraft that has a series of three ducted fans, two on the wings and one in the rear of the fuselage, powered by a hybrid electric drive. The transition from takeoff to cruising speed takes just 90 seconds, with the plane reaching speeds up to 345 miles per hour with a non-stop range just under 1400 miles. At the end of the trip, the landing only requires a helipad-sized surface. The downside is that each plane only has a seating capacity for five passengers. Number 2 The idea of a flying car is something most people would get behind, so it's no surprise that Samson Motor Works has created one that is not only affordable but has a do-it-yourself element that allows the owner a more personal connection to the vehicle. Switching from driving to flight mode can be done in under 3 minutes, creating an aircraft with a wingspan of 27 feet. In flight mode, it has a maximum airspeed of 200 miles per hour with a range of 450 miles. The company is currently taking reservations for orders with an estimated cost of $120,000. Number 3 Before we reveal our number one pick, we want to remind you to comment after the video and let us know which of these aircraft you'd prefer to fly on. Number 1 This final entry is touted as being the world's first all-electric fixed-wing ultralight VTOL aircraft. Measuring roughly 13.5 feet long and wide, it has the fuselage located centrally between two fixed wings, one at the front and one at the back, that have four rotors on each one. The single passenger craft has a range of 25 miles with a top speed of 62 miles per hour. The company hopes to be in production sometime in 2019 with an estimated price around the same as a standard SUV. And the coolest part, as of right now, flying one will not require a pilot's license. Hey guys, this is Cassie. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Tell us in the comments below what you found to be the most interesting and why. Also, if you haven't done so yet, Make sure to hit the bell notification next to the subscribe button to stay up to date with all of our latest videos. Thank you for watching. I'll see you guys next time.